No, you're not. It's just the food, Mama. Monday, after 6 p.m., car vlog. Something that I've always said, or that I, not always, something that I've been saying I want to not do anymore. You guys, I ran amok today. <laughs> I couldn't even think of vlogging. I took care of some things, important things that I needed to take care of. And it's like the day just poof goes. And then it's time to start getting ready for work. I didn't do my hair. I washed it last night. And then I put one of those little thingamajiggers. I love these things, you guys. It does not pull my hair, doesn't break my hair, doesn't hurt putting it on, doesn't hurt taking it off. Love them. I get them at the Dollar Tree. They come like in multiple packs, different colors. I need to learn to look at the camera right here. I'm going to buy a camera, you guys, for myself soon. Hopefully be before or by Christmas. It's going to be my Christmas present to myself as a an investment to my channel because these phone cameras are wonky except for my iPhone thingy but my iPhone don't work unless it's at home so meaning it's only connected to the house Wi-Fi so it stays home and this phone can you see how it's all blurry and and when I move the camera it like makes you want to get dizzy and sorry about that stuff um, I noticed on all of my editing how slow I talk. What? I was like, what? Do I talk like that? I know I'm not a fast talker unless I'm really hyped up on caffeine and, you know, that's a, sometimes happens. Maybe I need to drink a lot of coffee before I film because I, I really think I talk too slow. If you guys think that too, please tell me down in the comment section so I can like, you know, give me some feedback so that way I can make like repairs not repairs improvements so I can stop it <laughs> hope y'all are having an awesome Monday I got to get going you guys see you Thirty on the dot you guys and I'm still in the house um that's okay oh gosh I think that just gathering all my stuff all my things and I'm not gonna be late I always oh sorry it's so dark I'm making sure my hair iron is unplugged it's dark Thursday okay mama God bless love you. you God bless you text me if you need anything so my little brother who's here today I was doing the Ipsy Unbag thingy, Majigger. One of my items um, was opened. The box you could see was all crumpled, like somebody struggled to get the box open and then they opened a little, they took the, um, the little, I don't know, the seal, the seal that they usually put on there. And this was a Makeup Forever product, so I know it was sealed, it had to have been. I'm going to let Ipsy know. Um, I'm skittish about even using it or trying it because first of all that's upsetting second of all that's unsanitary anyway brother was here and he told me oh you look like you're losing weight in the face I'm like oh. I got all happy cuz you know he's he's like my biggest critic hold on one second I just turned the AC on and put my seatbelt on anyway it's just me and my brother brother it's the two of us so as far as sibling ri rivalry I can't say that word. You know what I mean though, right? As far as that goes, we give each other overdoses of it because it's just the two of us. He's my little brother. Anyway, for him to give me, um, or to even say that to me, I know that was hard for him to do. It just made me feel good. I did weigh myself, I'm 23 pounds down at the beginning of my fifth week. What is it with me and my, ooh, the sun. Um, at the beginning of my fifth week on keto, I went ahead and weighed myself. I have not been to the doctor yet. Um, because I, I was waiting to go to her, her scale. But I, 
used my sun scale. It's a digital one. It's fairly new, uh, very accurate, or according to him, very accurate. So 23 pounds down, and obviously it's m probably mostly water weight. My neighbors are very, very cautious about how people drive in this neighborhood, as they should be. But when I'm driving, I have to, if they see me filming, they're gonna, they're gonna ding me and slam me on, on our Facebook neighborhood group. Anyway, you guys, have an awesome Thursday. I'll be back and chat at you later. More about my keto um, and Ipsy. And I'm downloading them from her phone into a file. Look at the amount. Whoa. So here's my Ipsy bag. Kitty, say hello. Kitty, kitty. Look at he's wagging his head. Honey, say hello, precious. Say hello. No. He's being a little bit antisocial. Oh, he's not. <laughs> when, I f when I first told him to say hey, hit the bottom of his tail went dang, dang, like, you know, kitty language, don't bother me. <laughs> Hi, princess. Oh, look at those eyes. Look at that precious little face. My little Mr. Kitty, look at that paw. Oh, he looks so comfy there, doesn't he? I can't, I'm holding this. Oh. Oh. Sorry for all the shakiness. Oh, how cute. This is the bag I've been waiting for. So cute. Oh, how cute, cute, cute. Okay, let's see if there's anything else in there. Nothing. Okay. And let's open this up. Okay. Ooh, what do we have here? Makeup Forever Ultra HD Perfector. Blurring skin tint with sunscreen broad spectrums. SPF 25. This box looks a little damaged. 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 You saw I just pulled it out of there like that. Oh, I'm excited to try this. Gonna try it. Let me see if it was. And it looks like it was unsealed, you guys. I received this unsealed. I'm gonna tell Ipsy about that. Um, wow. I don't know. I'm afraid to use it now. Let's see what else I have here. Very pretty. So my brother got here when I was in the middle of showing you guys Ipsy. And so I stopped doing that. And we've been eating these chicharrones. These are keto friendly. And these are a Philippine, a Filipino product from the Philippines. Or, or no, they're made in the U.S., but it says Philippine style. Chicharon Kawali. It's garlic and vinegar flavor, and it's a delish. See me. Oh, I was going to come in here and say happy Friday morning because I'm just getting off work. Gosh darn it, I thought it'd be a little bit more lit because I'm in the parking lot. Go under the light. Ew. I'm on, it's a little bit more lit over here. Anyway, happy Friday. Good morning, you guys. I'm just leaving Trabajo. And I just wanted to pop in here and say, hey. <laughs> Friday. I'm, I'm, I'm on my way. I'm like... I need to go, but I just have to check in, keto check in. I was able to put a pair of these dark blue, they're kind of like this undershirt, no, they're a little darker plant pants with the drawstring, they're scrub pants. Um, I forget what the name brand is. It's one of those basic brand name um, 
Anyway, I couldn't wear them when I first started working at this new job because I tried them on and I had the drawstring untied and sp I mean, I pulled them up, but they were like, whoa, if I sit down at work at these, the butt's gonna go, the, 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 it's gonna split open too tight. I got them on today. I mean, I still look fat, but I got some pounds down and I can wear some clothes that I wasn't able to wear a month and a half ago. Loving this keto, you guys, loving it. Okay, happy Friday. I will see you Saturday morning. Yeah, it'll be Saturday morning. We'll see you. Doing some fall shopping. Yeah. Get the smoothies and then look at this right there. So pretty, it's got all these different colors. Depots. And I'm just barely getting up and it's 2 p.m. It's so pretty. you guys it's so nice out there. yeah let's go in through over there anyway that was so cute Hey, you guys so I'm just taking a little breather it's Saturday happy Saturday you'll be seeing this tomorrow which is today so happy Sunday you guys <laughs> um, I just got through eating carnitas and chicharrones con carnitas we went to the um, I think it's called El Cajete out there on Rosedale it's by the other Dollar Tree we I went to the other Dollar Tree today to look for some more fall floral that I'm I'm needing for um, DIY for my home decor. I'm excited to finish that so that I could film it and share with you guys. Excuse me. I also went to Home Depot to go get some spray for um, my DIYs for my fall decor. So I'll probably film that and show you as a DIY type thing when I put it in when I do my, I don't know if I'll do, if I'll include it with my fall decor tour or just do it as DIY. Who knows? We'll see what happens. So anyway, so that's what we did. We went there to Home Depot. We went to the Dollar Tree. That Dollar Tree was pretty picked over, pretty packed. But I picked up a couple of things that I've been watching people haul. So I found some things. Um... And then, like I said, we went to El, Car El Carete, I think it's called, the grocery store. It's a carneseria. 
we picked up I, some carnitas and I got some chicharron with carne on it and uh, we already had homemade salsa here so we came home and picked out on that mom got a half a dozen of tamales I didn't know that they had cooked food there just like they do over at Viarta and um, I can't remember the other store but anyway these are Latino stores and they have cooked food so um, I, mom got like three tamales de boil and three de, de um, carnitas or, or pork and and then like I said I got my little pedazo de carne carnitas and then I got the chicharron with carne and it, yes it was very high in fat very greasy very delicious I'm very keto friendly, you guys. I'm still on my keto journey, and I'm not having any cravings, any problems with that. Although, I've been watching a lot of keto videos, and I do do a lot of Google research. Uh, one of my favorite couples that I like to watch is the Keto Connect. I think that's what their channel is called. And they were doing like, um, they were testing out keto products. And they had this ice cream. Oh. And it's about, uh, they got, they ordered this ice cream. It's keto ice cream. And um, I went to the website to go order me some chocolate peanut butter. But, oh, my son's calling. Oh, you guys got to answer. So sorry about that, you guys. I took that call. That was my oldest son. So he was just calling to have a conversation with me so as I was saying it's the keto connect channel YouTube channel if I remember I'll link that video that I was talking about She's talking about ice I mean they were talking about all kinds of products that you can buy um, prepaid and have it mailed yeah pre-made anyway there's this ice cream that I want to get as soon as I finished watching that video I went to that website to go order me some of that chocolate and peanut butter ice cream they have all kinds of flavors but I was like I was like if I can have this is keto ice cream and they have chocolate peanut butter I'm gonna give me some a case of chocolate peanut butter I think they sell them like in a case of six little tubs that are about at the size of a Ben and Jerry's size ice cream anyway so that's my goal to get that ice cream you guys <laughs> I'm going to dig in and show you the rest of my ipsy haul and then call it a vlog you guys it it's been another week I can't believe like today is Saturday um, September 15th holy moly the 15th of September already you guys the 15th of September so as you guys know I love this bag look at the little zipper thing it says ipsy it's in gold i love the little girly eyelashes it's got the gold zipper this is what it looks like on the back and let's dig it dig in so i got this little matte bronzer i like the color that is my tone. Let me close this. And that's the brand. I will do reviews on these because I was asked to do reviews, beauty reviews. So I'm going to start doing it with these products. And then here is an intensive mask. It's, it's almost a full size, I think, maybe. It's by Joe Hansford. Perfect Care for Colored Hair. Oh, so it's a hair mask, okay, for all hair types. And then right here I got this a Thank Me Later face primer. This I will be reviewing because that, these are the types of things that I need for my older mature skin because I have pores around my nose and forehead. I think I showed this earlier. This is a really pretty cheek blush. And then this HD uh, Ultra Perfector by Makeup Forever, which I was really excited about. But when I first opened the bag, as you can see, this box was was like this. I, I had it in the first. It was like this when I got it. The box is all crinkled up. This is what I was upset about. 
And I am going to go on there and tell Ipsy about it. But this is the, and it's a good size um, thing, but I'm going to show you. Hold on. This is how I opened it. It was, these things usually have a little metal or silver seal on it to peel off. This was open. Someone tried it and it was spilled out. So just by the way the packaging was, um, I don't know. So this is what I was waiting for. Now I'm skittish about using it because it was open. I don't know. I just It just upsets me that somebody tried my product and then they sent it to me. I mean, that's obvious. That's what they did. <sighs> and I was so happy about I am happy about this month's Ipsy. Except for the part that somebody used my, my product and then sent it to me. I mean, hello, Ipsy. These are supposed to be new products. Or whoever you have packaging them, um, you need to put them in check. Wow, I'm complaining. <laughs> okay, you guys. I'll see you in the next one. I want to thank you so much for watching. Toodles.